A strike by Samsung workers in India showed no sign of ending on Wednesday. The group of more than 1,000 employees from a factory in southern India has rejected a settlement offer. The strike is the biggest such labour dispute in recent years in the country and has entered a second month. The strikers have disrupted production and protested in a makeshift tent close to the Samsung factory near the city of Chennai. They have demanded higher wages and union recognition. The plant is critical to Samsung's ambitions and made up roughly a fifth of its $12 billion India sales from 2022 to 23. Samsung this week made a proposal to provide a monthly incentive of 5,000 rupees or $60 until March. Documents also showed the South Korean firm offered more air-conditioned buses, a diversified cafeteria menu and a gift card of $24 in case of the birth of a child. The Centre of Indian Trade Unions, or CITU, is the labour group supporting the protests. Its state president said it had rejected the latest offer as Samsung didn't recognise their union. Samsung said in a statement it signed an agreement and will engage with workers to address their concerns, but it didn't comment on the strike it's still continuing. The union said Samsung workers earn $300 on average each month and want a raise of around $428 spread over three years. Samsung argues the average monthly salary of full-time manufacturing workers at the plant is nearly double that of similar workers in the region.